Hey, what's up, YouTube? Coming at you guys with a new video. I know that it's been a really, 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 really long time, but I've had a lot of things going on in my life, and I wanted to come and make this little life update video and fill you guys in on everything that's been going on. So I kind of wrote a few little notes of some things that I wanted to talk to you guys about. But one of the um, first things that I actually wanted to discuss with you guys was that I got married. I know that a lot of you follow me on social media, so you guys know that. But there are some ladies who uh, only knew me here on YouTube, so they weren't aware that I got married. I got married December 18th to that guy who was in the video before in my pictures. <laughs> yeah, so, you know, we've been married and it's it's been a, it's been a blessing. Of course, it's not easy, <laughs> but... It's, it's a wonderful, a wonderful blessing when you're with someone who you just, just feel like, you know, you belong. It's my lobster, you know? I also wanted to talk about my obvious weight loss. As you guys can see, I lost 75 pounds. I didn't have surgery, um, and I didn't use anything like Herbal Life or anything like that. I actually just, the day after I was baptized, I was laying in my bed and kind of felt this numbing tingling feeling in my leg and I got really nervous I got really scared like if it was a sign from God that if I didn't change things that's the feeling that I would always have and I didn't want that so from that day on with the grace of God and his help and everything I changed the way that I was eating I started eating healthy small portions I cut out red meat I cut out anything that wasn't water or my detox water the lemon strawberry water is my absolute favorite. I still drink it to this day. Uh, what else? I stopped eating after eight. I actually use kid size bowls and that's what I would serve myself in. I would walk a minimum of 10,000 steps a day. I'm very, very blessed that I have my family support. You know, I have my daughter doing it with me as well as my husband. He pushed me every single day to make sure that we got it done and and in less than a year i was able to lose 75 pounds so last year january i had started at 265 pounds right now <laughs> i'm 198 pounds now i did say i lost 75 pounds right those numbers don't really add up but let me tell you why i am pregnant <laughs> so i know that you guys again like i said you guys follow me on social media you guys know that we endured some miscarriages last year and it was a very, very, very difficult time, but I did share it with you guys because you never know who you can help. So we did go some, through some miscarriages and I actually kind of felt like, like I was done. Like I didn't want to try anymore. I was going to be 30 years old and I was just ready to give up. And as soon as I decided that I wanted to give up, that's when we come out pregnant. So I'm now about to be four months pregnant. I'm very, very, very excited. I'm going to share the pictures with you guys. So they've come a little closer so they can see. So this is my little peanut right here. So this was at 12 weeks and five days. And here he is upside down or she, you know, we don't know if it's a boy or a girl. There goes that beautiful little spine and that that head <laughs> so it's really exciting my kids are extremely extremely happy that we're having a baby one of my daughters wants a son the other one wants a little girl so that she can dress her up and boss her around i mean what middle child doesn't want that right <laughs> so yeah so we're having a baby so that's why i've gained a little bit uh, more weight I actually was extremely, extremely fatigued, very, very, very tired in the beginning of this pregnancy, even though I'm still in the beginning, but the very, very, very beginning, I didn't want to do anything but sleep and eat very bad things like bread and sugar and lots of sugar and salty and sour and not work out. So <laughs> it was going not so good. I have my energy back now, so I just started walking again and I'm actually doing uh, light weights. I do five pounds. I do small things like just, you know, lifting my arms up and things like that to try to tone my arms a bit. I go in and out with doing squats. I know that they say that doing squats build a butt, but for some reason I have such a difficult time committing to just doing it over and over and over. So, yeah, I'm also going back to my healthy eating because I don't want to gain the weight back. I do want this pregnancy to just be belly. So, <laughs> yeah, so I'm not going to eat 
everything that I see, but I will satisfy my cravings. Just letting you guys know that. So the last thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about is the traveling that I've been doing. So I've been traveling a lot lately. I haven't done anything international yet because of Mr. Cameraman. He doesn't have his passport yet, so it's a little difficult to travel internationally when your husband doesn't have a passport. But in the past year and a half, I've been to more places than I have my whole life because prior to this, I hadn't traveled since I was 14 years old. So I've been to places like Texas. I went to Baltimore. I went to Phoenix, uh, we stopped in Cali. I was just recently in Miami, that's what the video was for. And now I'm actually going on my first family dream trip. So it's next week on Wednesday, we're gonna be in Puerto Rico. We're staying at a resort and I'm so excited and I really plan on, I'm gonna vlog the whole entire experience to share it with you guys. So I'm really, really, really excited for that. <sighs> what else, what else did I wanna talk to you guys about? I am working very hard on coming back to my channel. I want to do me. I don't want to do what everyone else is doing. I want to give you guys me. I do want to share some of my makeup, you know, tips and tricks, but me. It's not because I'm a professional. It's not because I'm the best. As if you like my style, then you watch me. If you don't, then, you know, I can recommend so many wonderful gurus who just do bomb, bomb, bomb things. But if you particularly like my style, then you would watch my channel. But my channel is just going to be filled with everything. My family, our travels. I, I want to incorporate some cooking, some DIYs. Um, obviously, my girls that, if you guys, I'm going to show you guys them in a minute. But when you guys see them, it's just, it's ridiculous how much they've grown. Like, my oldest is about to be 11 years old. I cannot believe that. And she's going into the sixth grade. <coughs> Excuse me. And my youngest, she's eight, about to be nine. She's going into the third grade. So time has just been going by so quickly. I'm going to be 30 years old this year. I can't believe it, but in October, I'll be turning 30. And, you know, I'm having this baby now, so I'll be a mommy of three. I also plan on doing everything when it comes to this baby on this channel. I'm going to definitely give you guys our birthing story, all of it. So... I'm gonna have a gender reveal. My mom is extremely excited about this baby, so she wanted to do a gender reveal. So on September 29th, we go to go see what we're having, a boy or girl. Obviously, they're not gonna tell us. They're going to put it in an envelope and we're gonna give it to my mom. And October 1st, I'm gonna have a gender reveal. It's gonna be a very, very small, intimate thing just to find out if we're having a boy or girl. But I'm planning on having a very big, very big baby shower uh, in December. And, you know, the people who are here locally, any females who have reached out to me on social media, any females who would like to reach out to me, you are more than welcome to come. I'm sorry about that. I got cut off. My mom was FaceTiming me while I was trying to record this. But, yeah, so you guys will be welcome to come to the baby shower if you want. I mean, not just anybody, obviously. But I'm talking about, you know, if we've communicated or if you've wanted to communicate with me, then please, 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 please feel free to hit me up. You know, my Instagram is Dope Fat Chick. I also have my Snapchat. It's that Dope Fat Chick, but it's a D-A-T. Somebody took my Dope Fat Chick. I don't know why, you know, because I'm Dope Fat Chick, but yeah. So, you guys, follow me on those social medias. And, yeah, I think that that's pretty much everything that I really wanted to talk to you guys about. A little update that I really wanted to give you guys. I really, really, really would love it if you guys would interact with me and tell me what you guys would like to see from my channel. You know, let me know that you guys have missed me if you have. Um, yeah, just stay in touch, guys. I, I don't really speak to anyone the way that I used to, and um, I miss it. You know, I had some issues with my Instagram. I unfollowed everyone, and when that happened, it's just kind of just, you know, don't speak to anyone anymore. So I would love to meet some new positive you know people so if you're one of those people and you would like to chat with me please do so comment message whatever you know i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and i hope that you guys look forward to more oh yeah i almost forgot that i wanted to show you guys my baby girls so there goes jeleni hi <laughs> and there goes my chunky monkey Janani. Hi. <laughs> so she's about to be 11 and she's about to be nine. You guys excited for the baby? Yeah. Yeah, you guys are happy that mommy's pregnant? Yeah. Yeah. 
so yeah guys so that's you know the video i hope that you guys enjoyed did my best i'll see you guys in the next one bye